and welcome to my channel. My name is Maria and this is going to be the only intro into a number of declutter videos. So I mean what you're watching is what was on the title of the video mainly because I'm not going to be able to do this more than once because I am I'm upset. Uh, I did make the decision, if you didn't know, to not do makeup videos on this channel anymore, mainly because I'm not going to have time. Um, I just won't have time, and I had to get my priorities straight, and um, I can't be spending a lot of money on makeup anymore. So yeah, I'm very, very sad. Uh, there are a couple of brands that no matter if I am doing videos or not, I'm going to be buying from them. Chevious Place is one of them. Pat McGrath, Dear Katie Brown, I still intend to get all of their glitters. So I'm not going to not buy makeup. I'm just not going to buy as much as I used to. And I am going to be brutally decluttering a lot of my stuff. I'm going to take... All of my makeup and put it into one makeup bag which is a pinky rose cosmetics <sighs> this is the makeup bag I'm going to be decluttering into and what you don't know is this bag this entire bag is full of liquid lipsticks so if you understand the massive amount of makeup that I'm getting rid of. Mm. Anyway, I'm just gonna take all my favorite palettes, highlighters, bronzers, whatnot, and make them all fit in that one little bag. Oh, no, palettes, palettes, no, palettes, no. The, the only palettes I am keeping are the ones in this back box. If you wanna see that declutter, let me know. Uh, um, I will do it. I'll make it the last video. Uh, anything that I can sanitize will be going on Poshmark. Uh, stuff I cannot sanitize will be giving to family members, friends, things like that. So anyway, without further ado, if you want to see my declutter, then let's get started. Here we meet again. Sorry, you don't want to hear me singing. Okay, today we're going to do primers and single shadows and pigments pigments kind of because um some of them i i took out a lot of pigments because i can use them with my nails um like the like the neon pigments and things so i'm gonna just go ahead and keep those um but other than that we'll see what else i'm gonna keep as far as nail stuff that can go with nails uh the milk hydro grip primer i love this primer um i'm gonna keep that um the becca backlight primer and the becca front light primer <sighs> i'm not a huge fan of these i know some people that are huge fans of these i'm not a huge fan of these i'm decluttering these Um, oh, sorry. No, that's a foundation. Foundations I'm not getting rid of. Uh, the e.l.f. Jelly Pop Primer. I actually really like this. This is a dupe for the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. Um, they work virtually the same. Uh, this one you have to wait a little bit longer but uh, after you put it on than this one. But they're virtually the same. So I'm going to keep that. I'm also keeping the... Touch and Soul No Problem Primer. The Bite Beauty Change Maker uh, Primer. Um, hmm. No, nope, I'm getting rid of that. The Urban Decay All Nighter Primer. I don't use that either. Gonna get rid of that one. Um... The Becca Skin Love Brighten and Blur Primer. What's funny is I love this primer. I absolutely love this primer and I'm keeping it. 
Um, the other two I didn't like. It's funny. Everybody loves those and they don't like this one very much, but I fell in love with this one. All right. The Elf Luminous Putty Primer. Um, I'm keeping that. I also have the Poreless Putty Primer around here somewhere um, that I'm keeping also. This is the Tatcha Liquid Canvas. Keeping that. The Juno & Co. Miracle Moonshine Cream. Um, I actually, it's been a while since I've used this. I used to use this all the time. See, it's, it's actually pretty far down there. So I'm going to go ahead and keep that. Looks like I'm not going to get rid of too many primers. Um, the Tarte Timeless Smoothing Primer. That's almost gone too. Keeping that. And then the Fenty Beauty um, True Matte Pro Filter Mattifying Primer. I'm going to keep that. So yeah, I didn't get rid of too many primers. Like four. four. I got rid of four out of the entire box that I had. But at least I'm getting rid of some of them. Um, so let's just dump all this into one little box. We're going to set that aside. All right. Single shadows. All righty. Okay. As far... Oop. Sorry about that. As far as these pigments goes, these Sara Zar pigments, these are just freaking beautiful. <laughs> they are so pretty. Oh, look at that. Um, I'm keeping these because either way, eyes or nails, they can be used. And, oh, look how just shiny and pretty those are. And if you're looking for a pigment, that a really good pigment, look at this one. This is the um, pigment in Mystique. Just look at that. Oh. The glitter particles and everything that it has in it. Mm, so pretty. So I'm going to keep all of these. Plus these were expensive. This is an indie brand. A very small indie brand. And um, this little thing is very expensive. I think, I think it was $18 to $20. I don't know. Um, you can't get a lot of uses out of it though. I've got a lot of stuff to do these next couple of days. Okay. Um, these are, no, let's do the ColourPop. These are the ColourPop Super Shock shadows. I, co I cover them tightly because they really need to be sealed tight. Um, that's pretty. What's funny is I rarely ever use these. And I think I've, I kept all the ones that were glitter. No, this is a pressed pigment. Um, but I'm not going to use that. I've got that color in other things. Um, this is Mighty Morphin. Ooh, that's pretty. Okay. Yeah, um, mm, that's gorgeous. So we're going to keep that one. Okay. This one is in Like a Butterfly. Mm. This one's okay. Um, I think I'll get rid of that one. I think what I'm going to do is sell all, all of these in... Um, one lot. This is Ringlet. It is a really pretty pink. Nope. Getting rid of that one. All right. Um, this is Rem. Looks like that. Have a feeling I will be keeping that one. No. Mm, no. 
Um, warm and fuzzy. It's a tie dye. No. All right, Seventh Heaven. Oh, that one's kind of pretty. Looks like that. Oh yeah, I like that. That's pretty. Okay. Oh, what the hell? I'm keeping that one. I'm not getting rid of it. I've all I've gotten rid of most of these, so I just this is. Zzz. Ooh, it's pretty gold, coppery color. That one's gorgeous. Keeping that one. All right. Um, frisky. I believe I'm going to keep this one. Yes. Oh, so pretty. So pretty. Okay, that one I am keeping. I like you. Mm. Mm, that's probably a no. Yeah, no, no. It's that one right there. Damn. Okay. That was my husband. This is Liberty. And actually, I think... I think this one's almost brand new. And I think I have, I actually have a second one of Liberty. Let me look. Unless I actually decluttered it. All right, I'm most likely gonna keep this one because I really do like silvers. Oh, Ooh, that's like liquid gold. Yeah, or gold, liquid silver or liquid metal. Yeah, that's pretty. I'm keeping that. All right. This is Tassel. Ooh, that one's pretty too. This one's an icy white. Oh, yeah. I love that. I, I really did like these trios. The, the ones that came in with the smoke, smoke, smoking, whatever palette. Uh, this is Lace. It's a purple. Ooh, pretty. Okay, I may have something like this in my collection, but I really like that color. It's a duochrome, so we're gonna keep that one. All right, oh, there's another one. This one is Flying Circus. Pretty. I like that one too, so we're going to keep that one. Okay, a little quirky. Haven't used this. And since I'm going to, there's another one that I'm going to keep um, that is similar to the. Uh, let me, I was going to not touch it, but. I mean, it's pretty, but I'm not going to keep that. Banana Daiquiri. This is a blue duochrome, a blue to, uh, it's an odd duochrome. <laughs> not odd, but it's gorgeous. And this isn't an ultra glitter. It's an ultra, ultra metallic, but I really do like this color. So we are going to keep that. This one is in Jinxie. This is a satin. Not keeping that one. Um, this one is in Bay. Keeping this one. This one's really pretty. It's a duochrome and an ultra glitter. So pretty. Yeah, we're gonna keep that one. Uh, 
All right, this is a Super Shock pigment. It's Slave to Pink. It's very pink. This one is starting to go bad. So I wouldn't give that away, I'd throw it away, but I'm not going to. I'm going to keep it because that is like very freaking bright. And you know me in bright colors. All right, so shove all these. Um, the ones I'm keeping, I'm gonna stick in here. All right, special delivery. This is an ultra glitter. No. Birthday treat. I remember I got like 50 million of these. But I only kept one. And it is really pretty. So we're going to go ahead and keep that one. All right. This is IRL. This. I hit pan on because this is such a beautiful duochrome look at that like a greenish brown duochrome so we're gonna keep this it's IRL it's an ultra glitter okay peekaboo this is a metallic we are not keeping this one I'm gonna show you I'm not gonna swatch it because I want to keep it intact Okay. Telepathy. This is an ultra metallic. That one's actually really. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, we're keeping that one. All right. Now we have Roy G. Biv. It's like a pinky color. And eh. I don't I feel like I have a color like this, so and it doesn't really do anything for me. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that there. Deep dive. This is an ultra glitter. And it's a bronze. And I don't have a whole lot of bronze. And even though this is untouched, probably because I rarely ever go in there, I'm going to go ahead and keep this. All right. This is No Promises. This is a matte. And this one is already drying out. See? It's cracked. So that one's going to be thrown away. Cutologist. This is an ultra glitter. This one looks like it's drying out as well. Yeah, this one's drying out. So this one can be tossed. Um, cusp. Ooh, really pretty green. Look at that. Ooh, okay, <laughs> we're gonna keep that. Okay, this one, coconut. This is a satin. Uh, it's a really pretty satin though. Yeah, look at that, oof. Coconut is like one of the best blues elixir this is a mat I don't use mats anymore um, and this one yeah that one is starting to dry out so we're gonna get rid of that one and we have um, I think this is it yeah we have four more this one is an ultra glitter. It's all right, falling up. This is an ultra glitter. 
And I'm not going to touch it because I have so many like this. I'm just going to put it away. Um, Milky Way. This is an ultra glitter. It's like a pinky glitter. I think this one is starting to go bad, but I think my sister may want this, so I'm going to go ahead and put it in the declutter. All right, lightning bug. Look at this. This is a ultra glitter. This is freaking gorgeous. So we are keeping lightning bug. Oh, that's so pretty. And this one looks like it's about to go bad too. All right. Hello, goodbye. This is another bronze one. Is this an ultra glitter? This is an ultra glitter. I, you know what? I like this one better than I like the other one. Oh, well, if I find it, I'm going to put that in there because I, I like this one better. All right. So that is all my super shocks. And this used to be full and actually used to be full like this. So I'm going rid of quite a few of them. I think I'm just going to, like I said, do them in lots. All right. Let's do a dose of colors block party I only have four of them this is teal me more uh, yeah I'm keeping this one this one is not going anywhere I will swatch it though just to show you how utterly gorgeous that is oh, yeah keeping that this is leaf me alone Ooh, that's like a really Deep dark green. Look at that. That's so pretty. No, getting rid of that or keeping that one. Might end up keeping both of these. This is X ray. <sighs> yeah, I don't these are just these are just beautiful shadows. The block party shadows, I want to get all of them. <laughs> uh and then this is Sizzle. It's a red. You know what? I'm not going to use that one. We're going to get rid of that. Okay. Hey, I got rid of one. One out of four. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Let's do the KVD shadows. Now, I used this one today, um, and I do like this one, but it's a silver, and I can get a silver anywhere, so that one I'm going to declutter. Um, this is a pretty purple. Mm. No, I'll get rid of that one. And then we have... Raw Power and Swoon. This is Raw Power. It's a burgundy. And then this is Swoon, which is a red. We're going to keep Swoon and we're going to get rid of burgundy or the Raw Power. Okay. Hey, I'm actually doing pretty good on these single shadows. All right. Um, let's do these BH Cosmetics, um, these are like diamond, they're diamond dazzlers. These are like, um, the Kylie Cosmetics, these ones. And I, I have a feeling I'm going to keep all of the Kylie Cosmetics. This packaging sucks, okay? Usually I put it in like a, um, in the cap to do this. And I mean, they're gorgeous, but they're very difficult to work with. So just as far as you know, putting them somewhere and then putting them on the eye. So I'm going to just get rid of all of these. All 
All right. Artist Couture. This is in Spotlight Glitz. Let me show you this. This is gorgeous. Look at that. Oh, so pretty. Um, these, what are they called? Diamond Lights Finishers. I only have one and they're beautiful. I want to get some more, but I shouldn't. This is a sea green eyeshadow. It's Steve Laurent. I've used this before. I got it in an Ipsy bag. I've never pulled it out again. So, and it's dried up. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that. This single shadow in Candy Crush. This has made it through so many declutters, so many declutters. And look how powdery it is, because it's that old. I'm not gonna use it. If I haven't decluttered, if I haven't used it by now, I'm not gonna use it. So we're gonna get rid of that. Okay, so, oop, I missed a KVD one, this is, Paranoid, and that is utterly gorgeous. Keeping. All right, so let's go through these Sigma ones. I only have four, and then we'll do this Tarte one and the Urban Decay and the J Cat Beauty because I'm gonna have to go through those Kylie ones and I think I don't think I'm gonna be able to get rid of any of those all right this is a loose shimmer it's an open sesame mm, no we're gonna get rid of that this is tinsel this is more of like a gunmetal gray yeah I'm gonna get rid of that Okay, Felicity. This is almost a lavender color. It's pretty, but I'm not gonna use it. This isn't a color I would use. Okay. Airy. It's, ooh, that's pretty. Yeah. It's gorgeous, but I'm not going to use it. I already know I won't use it. Pageantry. Ooh, this is like a sea green. Looks like. Can't really get it because of my nails. There we go. And yeah, I'm going to get rid of that too. All right, we have Transpose, and this is a brown. Not getting rid of this one. I don't use loose pigments as much as I used to. I used to love them, and I used to use them all the time, but I don't use them as much now. Okay. This is one of the first shadows that, I've, that I got. And... It's broken, so I think I'm gonna just cut my losses and get rid of that. Um, Solstice, these two are those moon dust shadows. Zodiac and Solstice, I love these. I'm not getting rid of these. Uh, these are toppers. They are so pretty. Zodiac here. I also have a moon dust palette that I'm not getting rid of either. So I'm going to go ahead and keep these. And the thing about these is you can get pro palettes and you can pop these out and put them in there. 
they sell the empty palettes. So I may do that. Just get more of their moon dust shadows and just do that. Put them in a palette. Um, this is Tonic. Mm. No, no. All right. J-Cat Beauty. Um, don't even know. <gasps> I thought it had a sifter on it. It does not. Oh, I'm gonna get rid of that. I think I'm gonna do like a lot of just drugstore stuff. And just sell it all at once. This, oh, that's pretty. Oh, hello. Okay, keeping that. <laughs> I've got glitter all over my hands. I've got so much glitter stuff, it's not even funny. All right, this one is a blue. It's called a chromatic pigment. You can't really see Enchantress. This is pretty, but no, I'm not going to use that one. So we'll just go ahead and get rid of that. These I've had for a while and I haven't used them. These are those uh, chrome paint pots. This is in Martini. No, I'm gonna get rid of that. And this is in Fire Dancer. I remember when these used to be like the thing to get and now people have come up with stuff that's so much better. So I'm gonna go ahead and declutter these two. All right, now, let me tell you, this is what got me into Kylie Cosmetics in the first place. Um, I do love their uh, liquid lips. I do not like their eyeshadow palettes. These, the um, Shimmer Eye Glaze. God, I've got so much stuff on my pants. Okay. They are gorgeous. Money ain't everything. That's what this one is. And I'm going to get... My nails are getting in the way of, like, everything. All right. So this money ain't everything. There we go. Let me show you how these are. These are absolutely stunning. See that? It's beautiful. Okay, I'm keeping that. I'm definitely keeping this one. This is I See What You Mean. And it looks like that that's just beautiful oh i forgot to put the lid or the little cover keep the cover it will save you a bunch of pain and torture <laughs> trust me i had one that i lost and it dried up and it was horrible all right this this one in Good at being naughty. This one is red. And the whole reason why I got rid of Fire Dancer is because this is almost exactly like it. If not exactly like it. Let's see. 
yeah it's exactly like it so I'm gonna keep this one all right this is in dime piece these are just so pretty how can you get rid of something so gorgeous this is Ocean Child. There's probably some Super Shock Shadows I can get rid of just because these match them. So I may, what I'm going to do, what I will do later is go through the Super Shocks. And the ones that match these, I'm just going to get rid of. Okay. Um, Aquamama. Banana Daiquiri. Did I get rid of Banana Daiquiri? I don't know. But this looks almost exactly like it. Oh, wait, no. It's, this is more intense than Banana Daiquiri was. They're just, they're so intense. Very, very intense. It's hard not to like these. All right, this is more pie, please. And I'm running out of room. Just, I mean, for somebody who loves glitter, just the look of these, I mean, come on now. All right. Okay. Burnt Sienna. And this is more of a brownish red instead of the, like, Fire Dancer red. really pretty if you haven't if you haven't noticed I'm keeping all of these <laughs> they're never gonna I don't I haven't seen any more shimmering eye glazes this is brown sugar which is sad because I loved their shimmering eye glaze These two were from their holiday set. And then Coffee Bean. Which should be brown, but it's like a gunmetal color. Okay. Ugh. Those are all of the Kylie Shimmering Eye Glaze swatches. So, anytime they come out with these, I'm probably going to end up getting these. I won't get the palettes, but I'll, I'll definitely... Okay, that one's too much crap on it. Definitely get these. All right. That is my video. I had... Three of these containers full of stuff, and I whittled it down to one. So I'm quite proud of myself for being brutal because I wanted to keep everything. So um, that is it for this video. Um, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. If you want to see nail videos, hit the subscribe button and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.